Cities across the U.S. and here in North Texas are vying for Amazon's second corporate headquarters, promising 50,000 jobs and up to $5 billion in investments. Well, now we've learned access to light rail could help two areas here in North Texas lure the online retailing giant. Jack Fink, live for us in North Dallas with a story. Hey, Jack. Hey, Ken, developers are hoping the old Valley View Mall along 635 near Preston Road will ultimately attract Amazon. One of the developers here is encouraged by a possibility of building a people mover, which will connect to light rail. And just up the road, light rail has a promising future at UT Dallas. This is the UT Dallas stop. UT Dallas Vice President Calvin Jamison says the planned Cotton Belt commuter rail station that will be built on campus will transform the university, which sits in the heart of Richardson. The rail line connects East Plano with DFW International Airport, and the campus is already building apartments and pubs near the future station. You'll be able to land at DFW, get on a Cotton Belt, and then get off at UT Dallas check into your place, place of residence, and then go across the street to classes, or if you're visiting, to see research professors. With 28,000 students, access to rail and mass transit, UT Dallas has room to grow on its property along the Bush Turnpike. The university says it's working closely with area leaders to lure Amazon's second corporate headquarters to the region. We think at the end of the day, uh, we would be an attractive entity for someone like an Amazon. Scott Beck of Beck Ventures says he and two developers are working to lure Amazon's HQ2 to their Dallas Midtown project. He says he's encouraged after regional transportation planners just today approved a study whether to connect the Dart Red Rail Line in Northeast Dallas to a Cotton Belt station in Addison by building a people mover that would stop in Midtown. The stop, uh, it would be anticipated to be right in the park. Uh, we like to now uh, refer to it as Amazon Park. And Beck says there's more than enough room here for Amazon's HQ2. Area cities must submit their ideas tomorrow to the Dallas Regional Chamber, which will then make a pitch for the entire DFW region. By October 19th, Amazon says it will announce the winner sometime next year. Live in Dallas, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News. Jack, thank you.